But were other city policies or even criminal laws violated? While the TBI investigation is already underway, Mayor Barry could face investigations from at least two other groups. News Channel 5's Jason Lamb continues our coverage with a look at those potential inquiries tonight. Jason. That's right, there's a board set up to look for violations of what Metro calls standards of conduct and Metro Council might decide to investigate things themselves. According to state law and the Metro Charter, Mayor Megan Barry could potentially face at least three separate investigations stemming from potentially unethical or illegal conduct. One investigation already underway has been requested from District Attorney General Glenn Funk's office. Funk says that investigation will look into whether she and Police Sergeant Rob Forrest violated any criminal law like official misconduct or misappropriation of public funds surrounding the overtime Forrest racked up on trips with the mayor. That could directly lead to criminal charges and a trial potentially ending in Barry's removal from office. A second investigation could be taken up by Metro's Board of Ethical Conduct, made up of five people representing various community organizations. That would have to begin with a complaint against Barry, followed by anyone who lives in Nashville, saying she violated Metro's standards of conduct. The director of law would evaluate the complaint, and if he thinks there's something there, the Board of Ethical Conduct could hold a hearing. After that, they could make recommendations only, not binding decisions, that Barry be censured by Metro Council, she resign, that the DA investigate, or that civil action be filed against her. The city charter also allows for a third investigation, this one from the Metro Council as a whole, or any of its committees, if three quarters of the council, 30 of its 40 members, okays it, something that's never happened. And the charter doesn't spell out what the council can do with the results of the investigation, meaning it would likely just be able to recommend referral to the other investigators, the DA or the Board of Ethical Conduct. Again, we want to make clear only the DA investigation is underway right now, nothing else. Also, any or all of these investigations may conclude that Mayor Barry did not break any laws or violate any standards of conduct. Live in Nashville tonight, Jason Lamb, News Channel 5.